Hi, this is Jeff Scott from Sussex Installations. Today's video is a quick information video just in case you're struggling to get into your locks. Okay, so this video is in a situation where you can't actually get your key physically in the lock. The, the, the key only goes as far as here and you can't push it all the way forward. If you can push the key into the lock, then you should look at the lubrication video instruction, uh, which is on this playlist. So if you can't get the key into the lock, it's possible that your key is worn. It's possible that the key is bent or worn. And if you look at the key head, you want to check the condition. You want to check that this key is straight and you also want to check that the head is straight and can go in the lock without any problem and um, the first thing to do really is to get your spare key and try your spare key in the lock regardless that if this key fits any is working in the rest of the locks in your van if you try your spare key that's the first thing to do spare key lubricate the locks as shown in the other video other than that it might be a case that um, we can either clean up this this key if you don't have access to the spare key or perhaps one of the pins could be jammed with a bit of dirt so what I might do is take a small object such as a, uh, a, a lock pick and I might just push it in over the top of each one of the pins and then just push them down manually and if I put that in and I go through all the way there's six pins in here they start and I'm pushing them downwards so this is the body of the lock and the pins need to go down inside the lock it's possible that one could be jammed near the front so if I just push go over the top of the over the top of the pin and push down over the top of the next pin and push down and the next pin and so on and so forth until I get all the way to the end then I've been through all of the pins and at that point it might just be that your key is going to fly inside the lock if you're still struggling and like I say you don't have access to um, a spare key then it's possible we can just try and clean up the head of this key with a file Okay, so this isn't something I typically recommend customers to do, but it is something that could get you um, into your locks in a bit of an emergency in the event that um, just while you get a spare key from us. So the first thing is just get your spare key and try that one. If you really don't have access to a spare key and you can see that the head of this key is a little bit worn, then you can sometimes just take a fine um, file, something that's not too coarse, and you're just gonna rub it very lightly over the two sides. So if you follow the pattern, you can see the direction that this key is um, sort of filed in the first place, which is just in that direction there, and that side, and the same on this side. And just apply a small amount of filing just go very very small start small you can always do a little bit more don't apply too much pressure don't get carried away because you will find that the key already there's a small amount that I've done you can see the amount of debris that's come off of the key the amount of um, filing so just a very very small amount and that's all you need to do and then you can give it a try I hope you found this video useful and that your locks are now functioning just fine and um, if not get in touch via the website it's www.sussexinstallations.co.uk thanks for watching